Intense flames lit up the night sky as a massive fire engulfed the Jefferson Town Hall Monday night. It all started around 730 just as a nor'easter moved in. Firefighters first on scene battled 30 mile per hour winds. A call for extra help was made. Departments from several surrounding towns joined the difficult fight to control the flames. Jefferson's fire chief and select board thankful for their assistance. My first thought and my first um, thoughts were with the firefighters and the people here on scene. Selectman Kevin Meehan was taking part in the select board meeting. It's usually held in the town hall, but it was remote due to COVID-19. Got word of the tone coming through pages from some people at the meeting saying that the town hall was on fire. Um, at that point, it was kind of silence in the meeting for a few minutes, and then we kind of took care of what was was try to hear exactly what was going on almost as disbelief as it first happened. Built in the early 1870s, the town hall was the staple of Jefferson. It's now reduced to rubble. The town was in talks to potentially move the municipal offices out of the building. We had not really fully decided exactly what the plans for this building were going to be. We are in the process of looking at um, we have another building that used to be the school here in town that we we're moving to work into more of a municipal building. Luckily, no injuries were reported with this fire. Again, the cause is still under investigation. Reporting in Jefferson, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.